girl, stop it. No way. Take your beautiful ass back to the room right now and go lay down. No, I know you want to cook for me, but I'm not letting you cook for me right now. Because you're not feeling well. I'm cooking for you tonight. And I'm about to rub your feet. I'm going to rub your calves. You've been on your feet too much. And I don't like it. I mean, I like that you're moving around and being active and just like doing stuff that you want to do. I'm happy about that. But the rest of it is a no-go, baby. It's a no-go. I want you to relax tonight. So there will be no cooking for me. You can look sexy for me. You can go ahead and if you want to just relax in the room, you can just, you know, be damn near naked when I get in there. And I would be very happy with that. If I just so happen to walk in and you had your very beautiful ass just waiting for me in the air, <laughs> I can't say that I would be very mad at that. I probably would get very happy at that. It might make me be a little playfully aggressive towards you. What do I mean, playfully aggressive? I mean, you couldn't be terribly upset at me, right? If you had your butt in the air when I came in the room and then all of a sudden, all of my teeth were on your ass, right? I mean, like, that wouldn't upset you or anything. Yeah, you know, I actually think that my teeth marks are an excellent adornment to your body. I think they make your body look ten times better than it already looks. You want to see? Of course, I would love to show you. What are you still doing here then, girl? Go lay down. No, I'm not. I'm telling you, I'm not. I'm not leaving this kitchen until I see you turn your beautiful ass around and start walking that beautiful ass to the room. Because I know if I leave here, you're going to go in the refrigerator, see something you like or something you think I would like, and you're just going to start cooking. And then, like, how can I be mad at you? You're, you're, you're cooking for me. Like... I know you care that I eat, and I know, you know, it's all out of love, but I don't want that tonight. Only because I want you to be good, and I want to take care of you. King love it when you cook for me. You already know I am a man that enjoys his food. <laughs> but I'm also a man that enjoys you a lot more than the food. You are my food. I need you to survive. I need you to feed my soul. You know? Yes, I'm looking forward to the meal, but I'm even more excited about the soul food that is waiting for me and you in that room. Oh, yeah, have I never told you that you're, like, ten times sexier to me when you're just doing what I ask and just listening and going to the room and laying down and making yourself much less clothed and just all around just being a good girl, you know? I'm, I'm much happier when you're being a good girl. Yeah, I mean, I'm happy when you're not being a good girl, too. But, you know, then I have to I have to do things a little bit differently. And then you might have to get a little disciplined or whatever. I, you know, I'm, <clears throat> I don't know, you know, exactly what I would do, you know. But it might involve a little bit of uh, smacking on the ass. And uh, a little bit of, um, uh, you know, binding. I don't know. It just, it just really depends 
on you know on you and and how you feel about what you should do in response especially tonight why especially tonight because i value you in my life and today is just as good a day as any to celebrate having such a beautiful loving queen in my corner and i want to do that for you tonight i know you want to cook for me i know you want to baby but damn let me take care of you sometimes <laughs> shit it's you know i know i know it's hard for you not to do things that you want to do for me and like i know you want to take care of me and trust me queen i love you for that girl like so much i really i really i was going to say that i i want to kiss you up right now just for you being you and saying that and i'm not going to be able to resist myself i need to give you kisses right now come here Juicy. Mm. Why are you acting up? What you mean acting up? <laughs> you just going to moan into my mouth like that? Mm. I love the sound of you, girl. I love the sound you make in my ear. In my mouth. I love the feeling of you up on my body. I love this arch in your back. Naturally. I love your skin. God, do I love this skin. The smell of you is so intoxicating. It's like I'm drinking you down my senses when I take you in like that. Oh, girl. Oh, girl. What am I going to do with you, baby? What am I going to do with you? You want me to tell you? Shit, okay. You want me to tell you what I'm going to do with you? Oh, you are a good girl. Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay, baby. Then I will. What I am going to do with you is, first of all, I'm going to make sure that you are being a good girl and that you are listening. All right, so come here. Get a handful of this ass right now. Nah, that feels good in my palm. So soft. I like it. Now, as I put a firm grip on this ass right here, I need you to know that now, I'm not playing. Now, it is a direct order for you to take your fine ass upstairs into the bedroom right now and i am gonna prepare something delicious for you and i'm gonna come upstairs at the completion of that and upon the completion of feeding you and myself of course i'm gonna put dessert all over you yeah <laughs> all over you. Yes. Yeah, I, I said that right. All over you. What do I mean all over you? I mean first I'm probably going to put a little bit of the ice cream on your neck. And I'm going to lick it off of your neck. Like this. Just 
just like that. I'm going to put some ice cream on your lips. I'm going to suck the fuck out of those lips. I'm going to kiss you a lot. They're going to be very sweet kisses. Don't worry. And I won't leave any ice cream on your lips. I'll get it all off so there's no sticky, you know. But then I'm going to put the ice cream on your titties. I'm going to put it on your chest and it's going to slide down, you see, because that's what happens when ice cream melts, you know. You put it on hot things and it just melts. And I am going to lick that off of your chest as well. All the way down from the collarbone to the middle of your chest. Big, supple, beautiful breasts. I'm just going to just lick and kiss all over these beautiful, beautiful, beautiful breasts of yours. And then that ice cream, I'm just going to let it drip down your sternum. Down the middle of your stomach, yes. And I'm going to watch you squirm while it drips down your stomach. And as you squirm, I am going to slide slightly more into heaven. 